Blue Ox Productions presents. I wanted to update uh, some previous videos uh, where I talked about moving the, having to move the swing arm back uh, so you can get to the rubber donut, uh, which uh, sits up in here uh, between the gearbox and the drive shaft to the final drive. Um, I had stated to remove the shocks uh, and then remove the bolts that hold the swing arm on. And uh, this is the first time I tried this and it worked great. You don't need to remove the shocks at all. You just remove these two bolts, one on each side. They go in through the swing arm. And then all you have to do is pull the swing arm back. What is that, about three inches, four inches? And that gives you plenty of room uh, to remove the donut and to do whatever else you need. Um, I did this, uh, as you can see, I had to remove my gearbox because I lost third gear. But uh, just moving the swing arm back that little bit uh, gave me plenty of room to remove the donut, to, to pull the drive shaft back, to remove the donut, and to get the uh, gearbox out of there. So again, uh, pulling the swing arm back to do any maintenance on the donut or to get the gearbox out of there, you don't need to remove the shocks. You could leave them right on there and then just pull the swing arm back.